Good morning. This is a follow-up to the fireplace video. Uh, basically, what I have done is I've taken two pieces of uh, aluminum angle, uh, angle aluminum, and I've placed them up there to, when it rains, to try to help deflect the water away from here. It does not pour in the inside of the firebox anymore. However, it splashes all over this part here and ultimately splashes in there, which makes a mess. Um, we'll, we are going to wait for the rain to see whether that really improves anything. I don't think it will, but it might. The other thing that I did is uh, I, I have this metal here to prevent wood uh, that's burning when it falls out damaging the deck and um, I took this metal and I cut an inch and a half off turned it 90 degrees and welded it to the back of there so I get the ability to pick the uh, fallen ash and scoop it against something to put it in there otherwise there was a gap between these two and it would just shove the dirt, uh, shove the uh, burning embers onto the metal underneath of the fireplace. It was a mess. Um, the other thing that I did is I did assemble the uh, new grill gazebo. However, I have not installed the top because it's only March and I realize it'll get beat to death. My current project is working on a Blue Heron deterrent system. I have a blue heron that shows up every year and uh, uses my pond as a smorgasbord. He's eaten almost all of my koi. I, uh, I'm not happy about that, but uh, I am working on a deterrent to uh, try to discourage him from using my pond as a restaurant. More on that later. You guys have a fantastic day. I plan to, or at least I'm going to try to, and I wish it was warmer. Bye!